Welcome to Paper Quest. I'm Jesse. And I'm James. And we're two friends teaming up in our ongoing quest through the Infinite Library. During a main quest, we discuss our current buddy book, and during a side quest, we share our recent solo reads with each other. You can follow us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and TikTok. Please rate, like, or subscribe wherever you're listening, and check out the show notes for all the links in the description. Check the Facebook page for our upcoming release schedule, and consider supporting the show with our $1 Patreon, which also grants access to each episode two days early. But for now, please join us in another episode. This is Paper Quest. Hello. We are here with a very special guest and his own book review. So this is my son. Say hi. Hi. What's your name? Daniel. What grade are you in? Fifth. And you wanted to give your own book review for some other fifth graders who might be interested? Correct. Can you tell us the name of your book? Bad Guys. And who's it by? Ar- Aaron Babbley. Aaron? Aaron Babby. Blab- Blabby. 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 Yeah. And this is the bad guys in... Do you think he's Saurus? Yeah, do you think he's Saurus? And it says up here that they're making it into a movie. Is there a bad guys movie? Um, yes, there is already. It came out a few days ago. A few days ago? A few months ago, maybe? Yeah. Did you see it? Uh Uh-huh. It was really good. I'd give it, comedy-wise, five stars. But otherwise... About four and a half. So can you tell us, what's the plot of this book? What's the the summary? Well, the summary is that they are trying to save these... So they're all, like, different um, animals. And in Bad Guys 1, you'll see, but they're all, like, criminals... So, like, the big bad wolf and the snake from Adam and Eve or whatever. But they become good guys, or trying to become good guys, in their ongoing quest. Just like Paper Quest. <laughs> but um, they are trying to save the world from aliens. But they're coming into a space pod. But... They figure out sooner or later that it's actually a time machine. And they're trying to get back to the future so they can save the world. And is this a dramatic book or a funny book? Or a uh, is it real life? Is it nonfiction? What is it? It is a fictional book made from Aaron Babley. Mm-hmm. And it is a comedy. So, like, in one of this, um, Piranha says, Taste the Fury. No. Wait. he He's way too big. Swift. Splodge. And the Piranha gets shoved up the a T-Rex's nose. And this is, would you call this a graphic novel? Um, yeah. Because it's all, there's a lot of pictures? Yeah, I wouldn't call it a comic. Not a comic. Not do a comic. You, do you think it was easy for a fifth grader to read or hard? Or medium? Easy, but Piranha says some pretty weird words that I don't really know that well. So maybe it was... Oh, there were some things that you had to ask about or check in on, but yeah. most of it you could read? Yeah, definitely. Would you recommend other people read it? Indubitably. What kind of people would like it? Would like would I like it? Um. You know what kind of books I read. Do you think I would like it? You might like it, but you're more of a chapter book with no pictures sort of gal. <laughs> True. Do you think um, someone who likes fairy tales 
would like it? Yes, because this is about like fairy tables, tales, and a bit of the Bible because Snake, Adam, and Eve. Mm. But really, it's just funny and good fun. Yeah. And did it take you a long time to read it or a little time? Um, it took me less than an hour. So if someone wanted something quick to read, this could, this would be it. Yeah, or maybe even just like a short one hour read, but it feels like less than an hour. And this is a series, so would you read more of the series? Yes, I really want to get more books because there are... I have the special right now, but there are seven books. Mm -hmm. And you have one or two? I have two. So the one I'm reading you already heard, but the other one is the bad guys it's just the original so you have the first in the series you think we should get more yes there's another one that is them in they're going into a superhero school so can you to to sum it up would you what star rating between one and five would you give it Mm, i'd give it five is the best a four point three fourths okay and what would push it to five star what does aaron balby need to do uh what um, will make it just that much better just a tad bit more like more comedy a little some maybe some different jokes yeah so maybe the next one's a five definitely all right well Thank you for coming and being our special guest. You're welcome. And we're sorry about our dog. Yeah. Are they crazy? Lunatics. Should they be in a book? Are they the bad guys or the good guys? They are bad guys that are trying to become good guys. (laughs) Well, thank you again. Can you say bye? Bye. Thanks for listening. (laughs) 